Hey everybody, thank you for stopping in yet again for another one of my fabulous videos. So I am on lunch and hold on y'all. All that noise in the background, sorry about that. So anywho, I'm on lunch and I have been craving, well I don't know if it's a craving, because I haven't had it yet, but I've been really like wanting to try the Popeye's fish sandwich. And when Popeye's finally opened back up after our ice storm down here in H-Town, they did not have anything but chicken. So I couldn't get the fish. And I haven't had time to go back over there. And I don't have time on my lunch break. So I went to Jack in the Box and got their fish sandwich as well as some uh, bacon triple cheddar fries. Anyway, so I'm going to see how this fish tastes. I'm going to see what it do. Heavenly Father, thank you for this meal that I am about to receive. I pray that it is for the nourishment of my body. Amen. <clears throat> so right off the bat, it just looks kind of greasy to me. They put lettuce and tartar sauce on it the bread is toasted so that's nice and the fish is nice and flaky it's hot i don't know if y'all can see that steam but it's hot so let's see what it do mm. it's hot Okay, Jack in the Box. I see you. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. That's good. Y'all know the restaurants cannot serve water down here. I mean, they can't serve any drinks because they have to use their water in order to serve the drinks. And we have to boil water, which I'm sure in other states. So, mm -hmm. I'm sure in other states they have to do that too. Look how flaky that is. Can y'all see that? Okay. I'm thinking instead of um, these fries and the sandwich, I should have got two sandwiches. I ain't gonna lie to you. Mmm. That is good. Mm-hmm. It is way better than a McDonald's fish fillet. And I'm sure I'm sure Popeye's their uh, fish sandwich is amazing. For one, it's spicy. Shout out to uh, Beauty and Beach Journey because I saw them uh, well, I listened to them on the way to work today. eating their Popeye sandwich and y'all <laughs> they had me cracking up <laughs> matter of fact I'm gonna put their link down in the description box so that y'all can go and check them out they had me cracking up but <clears throat> they said the sandwich is really good and they were like in comparison to the chicken sandwich the fish is better, but I'm with them. I didn't really care for the uh, chicken sandwich that much. Like, everybody talked about it and hyped it up. So, I thought it was going to taste like my uh, grandma cooked it or like my mama cooked it. Mm -mm. No. No. 
Y'all, this is good. And I kind of forgot about my fries over here. It's like not rubbery, you know? Hmm. And I think it... What kind of fish is that? Like Alaskan Pollock or something they said. Hmm. It's been busy at work today, thankfully. People are getting back out. Let's see what these fries do. So it looks like the bottom of my fries are dry. The, all the sauce is on the top. <clears throat> it has a very potent bacon flavor. So if you love bacon, you will love these fries. They're good. I mean, when you need something comforting, something heavy to warm your soul. But I'm mad. Y'all look at that. Hold on. You push the, the top to the side. And it's just a bunch of dry fries under there. Like I ordered an extra large fry or something. They didn't have any of the... I wanted the jalapeno, whatever that was. It was spicy. They didn't have it. All we have is our triple cheddar. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. I just didn't want no plain fries. I mean, y'all know how it is when you have gone eight nine hours and you've been working you've been gone and you've gone eight nine hours without eating and you've been working you need something that's gonna hit your stomach but not to the point where you're gonna get the itis and want to go to sleep we're gonna change we're gonna say it's the food itis <laughs> The term blank itis came about, you know, a long time ago. But we're going to change it to the blank itis because we don't want everybody saying that word. If you don't know what I'm talking about, do your research. Ask somebody to know somebody to know somebody to know somebody. And you might find out. It's a slang term. Mm -hmm. Slang. Mm. These curly fries taste like Arby's fries. You cannot eat them without Arby sauce. You know what I mean? Like they they get kind of dry, get <clears throat> stuck in your throat. There is a challenge for you, Big Belly Bob. <laughs> Try eating some of these fries with no drink, no sauce. <laughs> Y'all know I'm crazy. Y'all know I am. When I say crazy, I do not mean literally. I mean that as in I am silly. Okay. I'm sorry. I ran out of storage, so the video was cut short. Thanks for watching.